aiming to energize New Mexico's rural roads for electric vehicles. The state has now landed tens of millions of federal dollars for charging stations. News 13's Marilyn Upchurch has the details. The work does not stop here. The work actually is just beginning. And that work is worth $68 million in federal grant money that New Mexico has now secured aimed at building three new electric vehicle charging projects for rural areas. New Mexico is leading in that rural utility nonprofit space by making sure they're not left out and feeling like they don't have the resources to participate in this incredibly important work. The biggest project will be led by NMDOT. The state agency is contracting with a company called Terawatt to build electric truck charging centers on I-10 in the southern part of the state. 63 million will pay for a station near Lordsburg and another near Vado in Doña Ana County, helping complete a route from California to El Paso. We know that growing our economy, creating jobs, providing new options for people to get around what is the fifth largest state, that that is all enhanced as we invest in our infrastructure and grow our ability for uh, zero emissions vehicles. In a second project, Santa Fe County will get around three million to build 33 fast chargers and level two charging stations at over a dozen rural sites like one near Madrid. Finally, the town of Taos is getting half a million for six public EV chargers, including one near the visitor center. At the town of Taos, we're happy to do our part in creating this renewable energy system so that way New Mexicans and tourists alike don't have to worry when they're traveling the state about whether they'll be able to find charging infrastructure. Marilyn Upchurch, CARE News 13. New Mexico's nearly $68 million award represents the largest amount of money given to any one state in this first round of EV charging grant funds.